Good morning and welcome to Simon Hills. So it's early morning here um, in Koh Samui, Thailand. And if you've tuned into my channel before, you may have come across a video that starts off similar to this, where I'm sitting early in the morning, um, having just finish my morning practice, which is um, a practice of about, you know, it's usually around one and a half hours, something like that. Um, so invariably I wake up around six o'clock, five thirty, six o'clock, and um, first thing that I'll do is I'll meditate. Um, and I follow the meditation by writing what we could call automatic writing or for me um this writing i think of as my conversation with my higher self or with god um and time to time i'm instructed to share this with you or part of this and this morning is one of those occasions and um this morning when when I was told to do that, I was like, oh, really, do I have to? Because I must, I must admit that I, I get nervous about doing this, you know? It's like bearing my soul. Um, but yeah, God was very clear with me this morning that I should share this, so I'm gonna share. So the... Um, the kind of subject that we'd got onto this morning um, is the subject of purpose, and um, I I was checking in on about my purpose. You know, um, I think sometimes sometimes I feel very driven and motivated and. Um, creative and um, so much is happening through me so much manifestation is is happening in my life and that feels wonderful and then there are other other periods in my life where there feels like there's a kind of stagnation and um, kind of the opposite a lack of creativity I, I guess and that's where I'm feeling kind of at the moment and so um so yeah hence i was kind of checking in with with god um about where i'm at and what i'm doing am i doing the right thing is there anything i should be doing so i'm just going to read you what an ex an excerpt from i write about three pages this is just about half a page that i'm going to share with you and um, yeah, and then just something I want to add after that. So, so I say to God, I feel that I am lazy and sometimes not productive. Again, Simon, your purpose is not in doing but in being. When there is work to do, you do it, and do it well. Do not doubt that. When you feel inspired, then you respond and create, but you cannot force that inspiration to come. Be open. Listen to me. Talk to me and listen to me. Ask me constantly for guidance. I will answer. I will tell you. Do you have... Oh, and then I ask, do you have any message that I should pass on to the collective today? Yes. Focus on being, not doing. Be kind. Be loving. Be at peace be forgiving, be grateful, 
Yes, you can make a video and publish on YouTube with this video if you so desire. It can be a good way to get out your message. God, is there an outer space of aliens and planets? Actually, I don't really need to. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll read this anyway. It wasn't really the, the, the purpose of this video, but um, I, I had nearly finished the three pages. So I, just towards the end, I asked God, is there an outer space of aliens and planets? Yes, but not as you have been told. There is infinite space, though everything exists in this here and now. You are all that is, Simon. Nothing else exists. I love you. I love you too. That's how, and that's how we finished today. So, um, so over the over the years, where really my life has taken some incredible twists and turns in ways that I could not kind of predict or um, or plan, that that journey really started to happen like that through my connection with God and my and my ongoing conversation with God. Um, not least through doing these pages every day, but also through through meditation and um, and it served me very very well, and it continues to do so. And I continue to check in um, constantly, as as God said to me this morning. I, you know, I need to, I must check in with Him constantly. Um, and he constantly answers. Um, and that message for all of us today is not to focus on doing, but to focus on being and being, being kind, being forgiving, being loving. Um, and, and to ask, and when, when inspiration comes in, then that inspiration is our is our me our message, telling us what it is, our purposes, what we need to do, and the word inspiration, which is I, has its roots either in Latin or Greek. I'm not sure which of those it is, um, but it means when spirit comes in. So we cannot force inspiration. Yeah. So this isn't really about sitting with your with your computer or a piece of paper strategizing what you're going to do this is about being open to receiving the messages from god from source from your higher self um, and receiving and then acting upon you know oftentimes when i'm actually um meditating something will just come through to me and i'll get up from my meditation and i'll and and i'll just write that down yeah because um because just that moment of inspiration can be the fuse wire that ignites the um, the momentum and and the direction that I need for for the for months sometimes ahead just in that moment in that meditation or in that writing. So yeah, I wanted to share that with you and. As you heard, I was kind of instructed to, or at least told that, you know, sharing this is a good way to get the message out. Um, and that's what it's all about at the moment. We need to get, get the messages out because we're all looking for, um, we're all looking for new ways to live in this kind of crazy changing reality that we're experiencing where our old 
kind of ways of being and living and uh, are not necessarily working for us anymore. They're not necessarily um, as relevant as they used to be. So, so yeah, the, if we can share these understandings with each other, we're helping each other, aren't we? Um, we're we're guiding each other. We're holding each other's hands. Um, and if you would like some more guidance in a one-on-one -on -one way with me, um, you could do that by booking a coaching session with me. I'm going to leave a link um, in the pinned comments below. Uh, and if you click on that link, it literally gives you access into my calendar and you can book in a session with me. The, the first session is complimentary. Um, so no, uh, no cost to you and no obligation to you. Just a, an initial chat to see where you're at and see um, if, how I may be able to support you in your journey. So thank you so much for listening and connecting and uh, yeah, wherever you are in the world, whatever time it is, stay well and have a wonderful day, evening, nighttime ahead. Namaste.